When darkness falls, it is complete. Race and the rush hour is over in Tavaska. Most of the skiers head back home and only few eager stay to enjoy the peace and quiet. It feels like there's no one else in the world except us. A perfect moment to relax and take it easy. Refuges, uh, there are different kinds. This is the one with the canteen and the dinner service. Uh, we are living in a dorm, which means that we are living with several other people and uh, we have to share the public places, the toilets and everything. And it's, it's quite heavy for me because I'm used to losing my stuff, or not used to, but I lose my stuff a lot. And then everybody keeps their stuff everywhere, so I, I have a really hard time finding it in the morning, which makes me even slower than I usually am. But I guess refuges are, as you can see, I'm quite relaxed. There's not much to do in the evening, so you can just think about what's going on in your life and what to do tomorrow. What can we tell you about David Sanabre? Well, first of all, he's the man. Good company, always happy and smiling. But as a skier, we want to know how he sees his backyard. I born here in Pyrenees. My family, it's, it's two generations here in Pyrenees. My daddy is a mountain guide. My mom is a climber too. My relation with the mountain, it's... It's I'm a skier, I'm a climber, I live here, I'm part of Pyrenees. No? Spain is a place for climbers. It's a very famous place for climb, but not for free riding. And the people don't know about um, when you think in Spain, you think in bullfight and sangria. No? <laughs> you don't think in free ride. But we have uh, one line of mountains, but it's 400 kilometers. I think it's a nice place. When you see on your side and you don't have 20 free riders near you looking for your line. It's everything for you. Another morning at the refuge. Since there's no one else than us here, there is no hurry to be the first on the lift. This is how it should always be like. Tavaskan is the place where we at, or actually we drove up the small windy road up all the way to Refugi de la Pieta del Prat. That's where we are. And you're supposed to go take the lift, walk up on this ridge, find some nice lines to ski, because it looks quite north facing which we're looking at right now it's been quite warm so we're gonna try to find our some nice things there's some trees lower down and some open alpine terrain here so that's our place how does this uh, area look like i don't know it looks big it's like a natural park and this this is the only road that goes up and there's this whole stuff of emptiness few refuges here and there, but no roads, just mountains. Being up there and seeing it all, it's this, this place has a lot of potential. It is time to play. David, the man from the mountains, takes us to his backyard. Since he's from around, he's the perfect guy to ski with.
snow. Crazy snow. It's like 20 degrees and it's 5 o'clock. Oh yeah. It's crazy snow. Spain. Where is Spain, man? Spain is hot. Yeah. We should have known that. Yeah. <laughs> Good day out means that it needs to be celebrated. We are kindly invited to share some jamón and wine with locals. Some of the best wine and meat in the world. I'm pretty happy, yeah, we got some good skiing in. It got warm, but, but really nice runs. And, and it's, it's kind of cool. Uh, there is a special way of drinking wine here. Uh, this was pota. Pota de vino. Pota de vino. And don't put this in your mouth. Me gustas tú, me gusta la mar, me gustas tú. Tastes good, eh? even better. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> like this. From the bottom. Yeah. Yeah. There, there, there's a freestyle. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm going to do that for the Finnish, Finnish yeah. people. Yeah, look at that. <laughs> oh my god, no! He's not doing this! He's not doing this! Que malo, shit, your tío! In your eye! Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It, it, it should go this way, yeah. and then you drink. Yeah. But I'm not. Yeah. I'm not used to do that. That's how you drink here. Please yeah. <laughs> yeah. Time spent at Tavascan is unforgettable. Good people and good memories, good snow and good times. It feels tempting to stay here for a couple more nights, but we want to go even deeper into the mountains. There is a lot more to be discovered, we think.